All right. Hey, everybody. Uh, here is a quick video uh, as we recap ARMS, our revision tool that we can use to revise our essays. We can use this to revise our essential questions, revision, revising our TDQs, or if there's revisions that we need to make in any other class or for any other reason when working with a text, a piece of writing that we have written. So ARMS is an acronym. It stands for adding, removing, moving, and substituting in general. Specifically, ARMS means to A, add in sentences and important details or words. R, remove words or sentences that are redundant, meaning repetitive or useless. Move sentences, words, phrases around to best support your thinking. That is our M step. And then lastly, we would move into substituting. This is where you will switch out different words, phrases, or sentences, quite possibly for academic vocabulary or maybe vocabulary specific to the question or essay that we are writing. When revising, you also want to ask yourself a series of questions to make sure that you have produced the best possible answer uh, and the best piece of writing for the task. Do I answer the question is a great place to start. Look at your writing. Have you actually answered the question that was asked? Do you provide details or information that would be helpful for the reader to understand your answer, your evidence, and your interpretation? Is there any background or context information that your readers need to know in order to understand your evidence and your answer more clearly? Have I selected the best evidence? While many selections and places in the text might provide really strong evidence, the question we must ask is, have I selected the top number one best piece of evidence to support this question? Does my evidence support my answer? Okay. If you have answered the question, and the evidence that you want to use does not answer the question, you have to revise something. Maybe you add, maybe you substitute, or maybe you remove, but you have to do something if your evidence does not support your answer. Lastly, does my interpretation explain my evidence, right? So part of that interpretation is explaining what the evidence means, what's really being said in the evidence. But then you also need to connect that piece of evidence to your answer. Both things must happen. Revision is not a one and done thing. It is a consistent process of writing, revising, editing, and writing again. And the process keeps going and going and going. The goal is that we become the best readers and writers that we can in the ninth grade. <laughs> This is one step to beginning that path. Thank you all so much. We will continue working on this and there will be more videos to come. Thanks so much. Be safe.